Um, I'm Dave Wiener and uh, I was part of what was called Capital Connections, which is an opportunity for those in equipment leasing and finance to meet with uh, senators, congressmen, and the legislative aides that help set policy in the U.S. Um, the message that we as uh, members of the Equipment Leasing and Finance Association resonated today in several ways with the fact that the majority, that 80 percent of our business ends up not being large ticket investment banking related transactions, but those that cater to Main Street, not Wall Street. Um, I represent the state of Maryland because I'm a resident in Maryland and was able to tell a story of the fact that the uh, 15 of the uh, 50 largest equipment leasing companies have a major presence in my home state and that was a surprise to those on the Hill. We talked about the need of having a level playing field in terms of, uh, uh, of access to credit and um, uh, tax, uh, tax policy. Um, the one thing that we were talking through was uh, making sure that uh, uh, we, uh, we eliminated some elements of Dodd-Frank that were onerous to small and mid-sized equipment leasing companies. Um, we, uh, uh, we were able to really tell our story in a, uh, in a way that I think helped uh, those that we're meeting with understand that uh, we're, um, we're not in uh, large ticket investment bankers, but we are looking to help recapitalize America, helping to make our country more competitive and able to create jobs because we were creating a better ability to compete effectively state by state and for the entire country in terms of being able to go uh, to sell a home.